Hey everybody, it's Andy aka Max Ryder. I've already gotten started as you can see. I decided to go ahead and record this. So today we're going to build a little barn out here at the horse stable. And we're also going to flatten this area over here and turn it into farm fields. Dang it. Like so. I also wanted to briefly talk about the game I ran for NerdCon 2017 last weekend, at least as far as when this was recorded. Uh, I ran a game I made wrote called Fear Jet. Takes place in 1971. Several people from corporate business America and New York City are being taken via Learjet to a seminar in Kansas City, Missouri. Unfortunately, things go horribly wrong on the way. Hence the name Fear Jet. Uh, the year is 1971. I don't remember if I said that. And um, had a good, had some good players. Thinking about chopping this tree down and actually bringing this back a little further, but I think I'll only bring it back one. I got 15. Six, seven, 15. That's as far as it can go. Uh, yeah, Just get a little bit more dirt, finish that up. Uh, so they've ordered the Fear Jet. A few of them spotted these uh, panhandlers in the airport. As it is ni as it was 1971. There could still be panhandlers in airports. Nowadays, they're so paranoid about safety, all that jazz. There's never any. But back then, there were. <clears throat> so the the actual... There's going to be fields starting right about here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That, that works pretty well. I think I can pull it back two. Pull back one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Five, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, oh shoot. I could probably get do better than that. One, two, three, four. Boom. Let's do it here. So this is the edge of the field. Maybe. And then the barn, I think, is going to go right about there. So. Hmm. There's no well. We should build a well, too. Hold on a sec. I'm not going to make you guys watch me do all these fields. Uh, I don't even know how many there will be. So for now, let me get these started and we'll actually do the barn today. Be right back. All right, so here's our little farm. We have wheat, we have some potatoes, we have some carrots. That should be enough that I'll be able to breed stuff out here. Uh, I'm also thinking that the barn is actually going to be set into the side of this hill. Um, that stays pretty straight, so... These are going to be, and then it's going to open right here, uh, right onto the field. I don't think this is quite big enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think six is big enough. Six might be big enough. And then we'll make it kind of length longish as we cut right into the side of this hill. And then it's going to have to be tall enough that the animals won't be able to get up on top. So we'll manage that. I'm going to get a foundation laid down. We're going to chop out a big chunk of this hill up to about here. <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> wow, excuse me. Sorry about that. Actually, what I might have is a doorway that leads directly onto the upper floor. And it's going to be a relatively small barn, mainly just for storage of grain and food and that kind of thing. Uh, let me get a foundation laid down, and then I'll be back to finish this story. Okay, this is what I'm looking at right here. We're going to be using jungle wood to build the main building. It's going to be pretty small. But, you know, there you have it. Uh, so... And I think that it's going to be built, yeah, like this, but we'll probably put a door in the end here. Whoops. Got to figure out how high we can go. 
So they board the they some of them see some derelicts and the derelicts whether they deal with them or not uh, are very friendly in that they offer some terrifying advice of have you seen the yellow sign uh, that kind of deal asking them those questions I think I need to make this one taller but the wind is on this level. So they board, they board the jet, we're off, we're heading for wherever we're supposed to be going. I could push this hill out and put a door, an entrance actually, right here. So... And then that would mean potential of higher windows. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm making this up as I go. So... They board the plane. Yeah, that'll do. They start making themselves comfortable, getting drinks, all that kind of stuff. The plane takes off. Everything's good. At least everything at least seems good at first. And um, then there's a weird noise. And they realize, they start, you know, wait, what was that? What is going on? There we go. So it's built into the side of the hill. Okay, that's a pretty good start, pretty good start. So they, they hear a weird noise. There's a bright light coming in through all the windows. They go and check with the pilot and the co-pilot. Uh, I think, I think we're going to use the spruce here. We'll use the spruce for the roof. Get rid of quite a bit of this dirt now. Just kind of move dirt around. Um, you come to they go check up in the cockpit. Pilot and co-pilot are gone. They are missing. There are no signs of the pilot or the co-pilot. Um, that raises the alarm. Everybody in the room starts to just flip out. It was actually pretty beautiful. Uh, they were just like, ah, ah, what is going on? You know, that kind of just total flipping out. It was great. Oh, let's do this. Yeah. Okay. So here's going to be the main body of the barn. Oops. For now, we'll do that. There's not a whole lot of room for, like, a loft. Unless uh, this barn actually sticks out a little bit on the sides. But I don't want it to take up too much room. This is a of limited area here. So we might just make this solid wood. Hmm. I think we'll go for spruce. For the floors and the roof. So let's try this. So, oh, that's probably way more than I need. But there you go. There you have it. So they flip out. The, um, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm doing here. For now, we're going to put a ladder here, but we might then expand that into an actual, some kind of hayloft later. And then I want... Yeah, and then I've got to figure out... Hmm. Gotta figure out how I want the roof to go, because I don't want any of the animals to be able to get up on the roof, but right now we're flush right here, which is kind of bad. Oh, I don't like how that looks at all. Alright, so, after freaking out, screaming at each other for quite some time, they, um, they start trying to figure out what's going on. More weird stuff happens. I had a lot of little weird events planned. There was a, um, 
they they spot actually a fight broke out between player characters um, one guy yelled at another guy and he went and got on this on this particular Learjet type it doesn't have an actual Yeah, this is just a storage barn. It's more of a pull barn than anything else. Let me figure out how... Hmm. Hold on a sec. 